The bronze medal match in the men's wheelchair basketball competition was between Canada and Argentina. When these teams had met in the preliminary stages of the competition, it had been a close game with Canada winning by just seven points. Argentina had won the gold medal in Lima in 2019. Now they were fighting for bronze. Argentina were playing in black and gold, Canada in white. Canada scored the first two points of the match, but Argentina were about to cancel that out. Maximiliano Ruggieri making the score 2-2. Two, two. Canada's number 12, Patrick Anderson drove forward with the ball here with Canada already leading 15-10. And Vincent Delaire made the score 17-10. A seven point lead for Canada at the end of the first quarter looked like a healthy position to be in. Both sets of players now had a chance to regroup and discuss their strategy. There were only three, three points scored in the entire match, two of them for Argentina. Ruggieri had the time and space to score one there, closing the gap on the scoreboard to just one point. And right at the end of the second quarter, Joel Gabas slalomed through to have a shot just as time ran out. There was just one point in it at the halfway point. Clearly, this was going to be a very close game. There was only two points between the teams here late in the third quarter. Ruggieri making a pass to Daniel Coper, who duly made the scores level at 44 all. And even later in the third quarter, Canada were awarded a free throw. Colin Higgins scored, giving them a slender advantage going into the final quarter. With less than seven minutes left, Ruggieri scored a two-point shot. The lead had changed hands. Argentina were now in front. But the match was about to go into a decisive phase. Gaut Osterchuk had time to line up a two-point shot here. And Canada were back in front. Canada then dug deep. In the final minute, they had a six-point lead as they broke away here. Ostep took the scorer once again. The game was over. Canada had dug deep to win a difficult match, scoring 25 points in the final quarter to win by eight. It finished Canada 70, Argentina 62. So Canada would win the bronze medal. The winners of the gold medal would be decided in the competition final between Colombia and the United States. The United States would be the favourites. They'd won the gold medal at each of the last four editions of the Parapan American Games. The United States in Navy scored there through Steven Serio. He went on to play a crucial role in the results. The United States were already leading by eight points here. John Bowie's shot missed. Ryan Bell scored the rebound, making it 10-0. John Hernandez scored Colombia's first points. That made the score 10-2. But this was going to prove a difficult game for Colombia. Serio was involved in the action here again, passing to Brian Bell. He made the score 26-7. And there was a serious danger of the match being decided in the first quarter. That shot wouldn't have counted. The first quarter was already over. Into the second quarter, and Serio scored two points here, making the score 28-9. And by the end of the second quarter, the gap between the teams would be 18 points. Jacob Williams scored the final points of the first half of the match. Realistically, the gold medal was already out of reach for Colombia, even though they'd scored one point more than the United States in that second quarter. And the United States were not in the mood to let Colombia back in. Brian Bell made the score 51-29. And right at the end of the third quarter, Serio scored with this three-point shot. Now the gap was 34 points with just one quarter left. The United States scored four of these three-point shots in the match. Columbia didn't manage any. In the last minute of the match, George Sanchez of the United States passed to Fabian Romo. He added two more points to the tally. And they proved to be the United States final points of the game. They'd won the gold medal match by 81 points to 45. They were the Para Pan American champions in men's wheelchair basketball for the fifth games in the row. And they clinched the qualification spot for the Paralympics. Gold for the United States, silver for Colombia and bronze for Canada.